lost a Wednesday night game in late April, but this is a huge ball game for everybody back in the Bahamas. There's Lucius Fox. You're looking at him. He's going up against Jazz Chisholm Jr. tonight. These two guys are now the first two guys from the Bahamas to play in the same Major League Baseball game since 1961. This is an incredible story, not just because they're countrymen, but because they're best friends. And here's Eric Fetty, eighth career start against Miami. Can he be as good against them tonight as he always has been? Jazz soft looper gonna drop in for a base hit just past Michael Franco who is over there with the shift so the Marlins have the leadoff man on to start the night Cesar Hernandez up the middle runner goes here's the catch the throw on target did he go by the bag yes he did Chisholm was safe and then he couldn't stop and the rookie umpire Dan Merzel did a good job of waiting and holding and called him out. And then he took the error out of Solaire with a big 78 mile an hour curveball, two outs. And him reaching, but he hits it well. Left center, Thomas to his right. Long first inning, no damage. Nobody in the National League has been better with the ERA than Pablo Lopez to this point. 0 52 as he makes his fourth start of the season, coming off one of his best starts of his career, matched a career high with nine strikeouts. Gets the strikeout. It's the changeup. His first of the night. One away. Well, and there's that nasty changeup right there that they're hitting a buck 36 off of. And that's lifted out toward left field. Solaire heading toward the corner will have room for the second out. Nelson Cruz, the DH, will bat. Grounds one on the first pitch to third. Wendell goes the short way. And Pablo works around the two out walk. Scoreless after one in D.C. A strikeout there for Pablo. He's got two tonight. Fastball pass Yadiel Hernandez. And that's actually a little backdoor cut ball right there. That's kind of nasty. He has been unhittable almost. Yeah, it equates to a 164 ERA on the season. He picks up two more strikeouts in this inning. Three on the night. Pablo looking sharp. Zeus Aguilar will walk his first time. We'll dig in. And Aguilar sends one deep out to left center field. This one's at the wall and it's gone. Just over the wall and left center for Jesus Aguilar. Solo home run to get the Marlins on the board. Gets one of those backdoor cutters, comes right back in the middle of the plate, and he knows back on that backside, stays through it, tosses the bat, goes into the jog, and put it on the board. Top five, Wendell Rojas Stallings. That's going to come back and get the outside edge. Joey Wendell knew it. Strikeout number five for Eric Fetty. Now the pitch swung on and hit in the air. Left field line coming in is Yadiel Hernandez circling under it and makes the catch for the out. Broken bat. Juan Soto because it wasn't hit hard enough couldn't get there. He goes for the assist and you hope that ball doesn't go into the camera well. And on an unnecessary throw by Juan, it does. They'll have to give him an error on that. He had no chance to get the runner at first. 3 1. And now it's 2 on. Eric Fetty's out of this game. Andres Machado is going to go back to back nights. Gave up a hit and an unearned run last night. Runners on the move. Bases loaded. The nine, one, and two hitters have all reached. And here's the dangerous Solaire. Here it comes to Solaire, and he's patient, takes ball four. So that walks in a run. Marlins extend their lead. It's two nothing. Nice. Swing and a miss. 96 upstairs. The Marlins, with all of that, get just one run with one hit. There were three walks in the end, an error, and three men left the board. And then he freezes him on a pitch inside corner. Pablo Lopez with his fifth strikeout tonight. One away in the fifth. Another strikeout for Pablo. Back to back K's, and he's got six tonight. The number nine hitter and shortstop, Lucius Fox, grounds one to his buddy, Jazz Chisholm. How about Pablo? A one, two, three, fifth. Bouncing ball to second. Six scoreless innings for Pablo Lopez. Best ERA in baseball right there. Anthony Bass goes back to work. Last of the eighth inning, he got the final out of the seventh. Franco to left. Solaire 
makes the catch. Actually, it's Brian De La Cruz out there, just replaced Soler. Ground ball to first. Aguilar will race to the bag and get the out. Two up and two down here in the eighth inning. And Soto hits it straight up. Chisholm, and he doesn't get to it. The ball falls untouched. That was interesting because Rojas was looking at Chisholm. Rojas was actually closer to the ball when it first went up. And he never did make contact with it with the shortstop right behind him. And the bases somehow are loaded here. And they're loaded up. And Nelson Cruz will be the batter. Ball four. It's a two to one game. What a rally. And Cruz gets his 10th RBI on that. That's a fly ball hit out to deep left center field. Sanchez drifting onto the track will make the catch. Bottom of the ninth inning here at Nationals Park. One ball, two strikes. Runner goes. Here it comes. There it goes out to left. De La Cruz drifting back. He's got a beat on it. Makes the catch. It's a Marlins win. A nail biter tonight in D.C.